Today, we are going to make a push stick and get acquainted with the wood shop using a miter saw, table saw, band saw, and drill press. For this project, you will need eye and ear protection, a length of wood, tape measure, a speed square, pencil, a miter saw, a table saw, a band saw, and a drill press. Follow all safety procedures before using any piece of carpentry machinery. Let's get started. Using a tape measure, measure your wood and make a mark at 14 inches. You can use a speed square to extend your mark across the wood. Next, using a miter saw, make a cross cut at your mark. Next, we need to cut the wood to the correct width. Measure and mark approximately three to four inches across the wood, or use a pre-made push stick for reference. Use a table saw to make the cut. Use a push stick to keep your fingers out of the path of the blade. Always ensure that your blade is at least three gullets above your wood piece before making the cut. After cutting our push stick down to size, we need to cut out a notch using a bandsaw. The bandsaw allows for you to have more control over your cuts and is great for making irregular cuts. Mark the shape you would like to cut on your push stick, keeping your wood flat against the table. Carefully make your cuts. For more complicated cuts, it's important to remember that the blade itself does not move and that the cuts are entirely based on how you move the wood. Last, we want to drill a hole in our push stick so that we can hang it in our workshop. To do this, we're going to use a drill press instead of a common electric drill. This is to ensure that the hole is centered and straight. Be sure to anchor your wood in two places and drill the hole. For a cleaner, more even hole, use a Forstner bit as shown here. Congratulations, you've created a push stick. Be sure to clean up your workspace and leave it better than how you found it. Now that you've tackled your first carpentry project, what are you gonna make next? If you're interested in following along with my personal journey, you can find me at thewoodenmaven.com or on social media on Instagram and YouTube and Pinterest at Wooden Maven, that's W-O-O-D-E-N-M-A-V-E-N. -E -E Thank you so much for watching.